Hello everyone. We are at uh, this little guy, Aaron's uh, storage unit. And the reason why we are here is because he did a video on his channel. How long ago was that? Uh, a month or two ago. So a few months, yeah. a couple months ago, a few months ago, he did a video where he showed everything he has in here. And um, you guys always ask, you know, why does he buy Mario games? Where was he doing with them? He buys every single one. Well, this is where they go. It's sort of like his, his vault or his investment. Yes. And it's also to, uh, to Crazy K proof his, uh, his investment. I he keeps it I here. I wasn't going to say his name just in case he watches this. <laughs> but, yeah. Of course. It's so Kenneth get Ken Yeah, Kenneth can't get in here. He'd have to climb some fences and stuff. But anyway, so let's take a look inside. Go ahead and crack the, uh, the vault open here. Woohoo! We're going in. Aaron's just gonna sort of a freestyle dig around and show some stuff. This this box has a bunch of like uh, boxed Game Boy and Game Boy Advance games. Um, there's that super rare, go ahead and pull, yeah, that stadium events, man. I can't believe you have that. Factory seal. Yeah, right. That, some, some of you might remember on a uh, previous video, you know, on one of the video games episodes, um, he had fooled uh, Josh into thinking for like a millisecond that it was real. And, uh, and then we fooled a few other people. It was fun. Here we have a uh, boxed Xbox, Nintendo, a couple 64s he just got recently, and a uh, 64 controller, <laughs> and a, a sealed... I think you actually talked to him into buying this. Yeah, I convinced him to buy that a, a while ago, Ninja Gaiden 3 Collector's Edition. So here we have, what are they? Luigi Mansion. <laughs> all, all sealed, all factory Factor sealed. sealed. Uh, we got sealed. Three sealed. Paper Mario. This one... I don't know. The seal's it, coming it, it's undone. It's sealed, but it looks like, I don't know, whoever sealed it messed up. <laughs> one of Aaron's classic 95% seals. Oh, yeah, i, I got to show you one of the ones I got a Felicia in a second. From, oh, okay. From, these yeah. are sealed. All right, all the, all the, pretty much this whole tub right here, uh, most of this stuff is sealed. I thought I had more than these, than one sealed, but. Kingdom Hearts. Maybe not. These yeah. two are sealed. Some Wii U titles. At the bottom down there, you can see. A bunch of Kirby's Dream Collection. Those are almost all of them are sealed. Yeah. Actually, all those are sealed. All those are sealed. We have a bunch of Zelda, Twilight Princess that are still sealed. Got that uh, retro Hostess snack cake uh, stand right behind you. That's pretty yeah, sweet. I bought, you probably remember that. I bought that at the flea market. Yeah, yeah. How much was that? Oh, like 15, 10 or 15. It was cheap. <laughs> I'm actually going to uh, snag one of the Kirby 20th Anniversary Collections. I didn't pick it up when it came out because I own all these games. Um, but I figure while currently the price is pretty low, Aaron just grabbed a bunch of these for, what was it, $7? Yeah, $7 oh, a piece were. at Best Buy, thanks to, uh, I forget what his name was, some, one of my YouTube fans. Yeah. So go check it out. He left a comment on one of his videos saying they're really, really cheap at Best Buy right now, so. Um, but I want the, like, the CD soundtrack and a little collectible book, and like, like I said, these are all sealed, so it's a brand new copy. To continue on the uh, sealed selection, we have one, two, three, three copies of Super Mario Galaxy 2 sealed. Um, there's a couple of Pandora, or a few Pandora's Towers sealed up there. Yeah, Got a see. bunch of... Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven sealed Donkey Kong. You know what? I only got seven of those. <laughs> only seven? Damn. I want to have at least ten of each. That's... That, that, that's his, sad. I'm gonna have to go get some more of those. His goal is he would love to have one tub full of each like sealed thing. So like a whole tub full of sealed Super Mario Galaxy 2s, another tub full of Donkey Kongs. Now can, can you can you find Waldo? Can you find <laughs> Waldo down there? <laughs> this this one is just uh, there, there, retarded. There was a Waldo in there if you could find a him. A Waldo? What do you mean? L like like something that that's off. Uh, what it's supposed to be? It's on it's on the top row. Oh, it's on the top row. Yeah. Uh, oh wait, I see it, I see f it. F find the game that doesn't, <laughs> doesn't match the rest. What the fuck? That's interesting. Hmm. Look at that. that Sealed is... white case. That's, Limit, that's rare. That's, that's like a thousand dollars right yeah, there. Easily. This is one of the ones that come from like Best Buy where they reseal it. And it the, they do a good job of resealing it, but it's clearly not the you know original seal and not yeah. the original case. But a lot of these are the original seals, yeah. um, and that's just that's going to be an insane insane amount of money if if you actually hold on to those all sealed like that. Yeah. I'd go bury them in the ground if I were you. <laughs> and there you go. There's more sealed Super Smash Bros than anyone needs ever for the Wii. Uh, <laughs> how how much of this stuff did you pay like? It, with actual cash, or most of it was store credit. Pretty much all of it was store credit. I don't, I don't, I don't do the. <laughs> I'm gonna give you full price and then sell it. Because if I paid cash, then I'm probably not gonna make much money off it. Yeah. 
So he'll he'll go, you know, garage, your garage sales or flea markets or whatever, get certain items, um, and then go trade those in for what he wants. Obviously, the Mario stuff. Um, so he's technically, you know, not paying a ridiculous amount because maybe he got the item for 15 bucks, you know, at the flea market, and he trades it in and gets something that was, you know, 40 bucks or something like that. So, so there's five and a half sealed Mario Party nines. This one uh, was technically new, but it was a uh, opened copy that they there was the last copy at the store. So. Um, and then we have a bunch of Super Paper Marios, all the like, Nintendo Selects. Uh, we got Kirby Epic Yarn. There's three Kirbys to one of them. Oh, there's one up there. On top row, where you fit down Mario there. Party 8. And then obviously not sealed, but like uh, some GameCube titles in here. We got Soul Calibur, uh, Bomberman, Sonic Heroes, Sonic Mega Collection. Um, oh, this is actually a little harder to find. Summoner Goddess Reborn on the GameCube. Uh, Bat and Kaidos, Bloody Roar, X Men Metroid. Star Fox and Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, so some decent uh, GameCube titles down there. And here we have more retro stuff, a lot of boxed games, some uh, you know some classics like Pool and Super Tennis, <laughs> but there are some good ones in here. Mario 64, Castlevania. This I got behind Joey's booth when he was still there, but look at the back. Oh, where they they cut out the barcode, but it's know. technically. It's like, well, is it is it sealed on the sides? Yeah. Yeah, everywhere else is is, is sealed. They so just I mean, slice the barcode off. So it's like it's one of Aaron's uh, ninety-five percent sealed games. Yeah, I got, <laughs> I got a few of those in here. And uh, we got Ren and Stimpy. But v these were definitely not sealed. What they did was they just took the side off the box to yeah. pull the game out. Yeah. So obviously those were played. Uh, punch out. This actually was this my box. Yes. That was a box I got for 50 cents at a garage sale, I think. <laughs> and then Nightmare Before Christmas Factory Sale. Woohoo! And what's underneath? It's just some oh. stuff. Just oh, a bunch of. Oh, hold on. There's actually some good stuff. Oh, Conquer there. Live and Reload. Yeah, two copies of Conquers, two copies of Call of Duty. I actually have three Conquers. I got a third one for my cousin. But this is a uh, this is a really good horror game on the Xbox. If you guys have never played it, Call of Cthulhu, you should check it out. It, it's like 20 bucks or so, roughly, give or take. And uh, we got yep. a bunch of Disney movies. Awesome. Okay. This is the uh, Nintendo bin. Got a bunch of Mario 3s and 2s. First Turtles game. I see Castlevania Simon's Quest. Final Fantasy. <laughs> this one had an 1899 sticker on it. Did you, you know, didn't pay that, did you? You know where I got that from. Where? That's my point at. M &M oh, Mario's. from M&M. &M. <laughs> I traded them sport titles. Oh, okay. And Castlevania 2. Bunch of Donkey Kongs. A lot of N64 games. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Say that again. <laughs> I said, and no, these are not Tony Hawk Pro Skaters because the yellow back. <laughs> They're Donkey Kongs. Donkey Kong 64. Five of those. What else? Yeah, okay. do eight, two, eight. Now, well, I have one question. Why don't you bring some of these to the market and actually sell them? Because these have been out for so long, you know, it's like they, they are going up in price, some of them a yeah. little bit, but at the same time, it's like some of them might actually possibly drop in price, you know. Yeah. You should. I would recommend you should probably sell some yeah, of this. I was actually going to ask you about that. Yeah. Later. These are uh, Pokemon Stadiums. <laughs> Mystery Cart. <laughs> Bob Bob Shed. Oh, okay. Pokemon Stadium. Pokemon Stadium. Pokemon Stadium. Yoshi Stories. And I'm not sure if I missed this or not, but there was a few Smash Bros. Oh, there's the other one. There's one. There's one. Hey, you Pikachu's. Where's the microphone? I got one microphone somewhere. <laughs> I just don't know where it's at. And Star Fox. No. There should be a few Star Fox. Star Fox. Oh, that's a 007. 007, 007, 007, 007. Yeah, bring some of those. God damn it. <laughs> Aaron says that this is uh, might be his favorite tub. One of them. It's the, uh, the GameCube tub with the insane Mario Kart. How many are there? Nine. Nine Mario Karts. Some Mario Golf and Tennis. Uh, baseball. Strikers. And, and just a few random. You're probably wondering why these these aren't random. These are still Mario's. They're oh, they're just in different. Mario Party ones. Six. Oh, okay. Mario Party Seven. Gotcha. And then at the bottom is the remainder of the Mario stuff. Oh, okay, Luigi's Mansions, Mario Party Seven, Mario Party Six, Mario Party Five, Four, Paper Mario's, Smash Bros, and uh, some five, Sunshines. Five copies. I got six. That's the Sunshine there. And another Soul Calibur. Jesus. And none none of those are sealed, though, correct? No. Okay. I wish. <laughs> yeah, that would be a, a good $5,000 tub or so right there. Well, this sucks. What? What sucks? 
Well, now I gotta pull the seal. <laughs> he doesn't. Is, oh. It sucks because he doesn't have enough room to fit all the fucking Mario All Stars yeah. he has in there. But we have uh, three complete ones. And uh, one of them is a uh, one sealed factory sealed. So one still sealed, and then a bunch of just you know the games open. Uh, lots of Mario Galaxies, and I thought we were, I didn't realize we had one more whole bin. Um, and then underneath we have I see. The uh, Fortune Streets. Now, there's something interesting about the Fortune Streets. There's also a, a, a Waldo to these two. Um, Those are still like in their little four stack of four. Yeah, still so wrapped up. It's even got the thing. So that's that's even kind of that's kind of cooler that you know they're going to be sealed, but then they're also in their little bundles. So that's very cool. Yeah. And then we got... I should have ordered more of those, but you told me not to. Yeah, I well, I figured you had enough Fortune Streets. I was like, don't, don't, you don't need to get any more of those. I just like they're sealed in fours. It's hard to get the... And we got some Pikmin 2. Jesus Christ, we got a lot of Pikmin 2s. Damn. Um, what, what, well, at least, what, the 12? The story behind the Pikmin 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14 of them. The story behind the Pikmin's was uh, I had no choice. <laughs> what, why? Best Buy had a clearance sale. They were four ninety nine a piece. Okay, well. And then um, Target also had a special that week. Buy two, get one free. So I went to Target and I got buy two, get one free for $4 a piece. So I got three for 10, three for 10. <laughs> And, well, you see how they add it up. Aaron Aaron does a lot of, uh, like, you know, coupon matching or whatever. Like, he'll go to a store, and if, if uh, one place had a sale, he'll see if they'll match their coupon. And uh, I, he does that all the fucking time. I mean, I'm, I'm like the garage sale person. You know, I go to the garage sales early in the morning, and I'll be out there five hours. But he is always looking to make sure what places are, you know, having games on sale, uh, where you can get buy two, get one freeze, all that kind of crap. So that's, that's how he uh, has gotten... About, I'd say, 80% yeah. of this sealed shit. Yeah, probably. What's in the bag? What's in the bag? I'm gonna guess uh, Game Boy stuff, probably. Because it sounds like it's rattling around. Yep. So, probably 90% of all this is Pokemon and Mario. Yes, there's more Mario. And more Mario, and of course more. We don't need to pull out every single thing. I think we... Yeah. Oh, there's the... Adventure Island 2. Well, yeah, that's why I was pulling up because there are some that aren't Mario's. Mario's but, yeah. <laughs> Donkey Kongs. Bunch of those. There's a lot of Tetrises in here. Yeah, because I thought Tetris would be something. <laughs> I don't really count those more like three dollars, three or four bucks when I did when I did my math on it. Oh, if I could find it, look at this one. Oh, uh, the I, actually this was mine. This came from a viewer in Europe. Uh, I believe that came from Mr. Disney Games, um, and it was at <laughs> Joey's booth. So, Mr. Disney Games, we just discovered your game. Oh. It, it had been passed along from Joey to Aaron via Crystal 123 or 123 and 1 Ultimate right Challenge. Battling. Yeah, it's also the guy who rap battled Aaron at one point on uh, YouTube. Here's the label. Te oh, poor Tetris label. Kind of it. This is the uh, final bin we're going through. Uh, it's the Super Nintendo bin. Mega Man X2. Mario Kart, and some of these, you know, have a little bit of label peeling up and stuff. Killer Instinct, Link to the Past, and Star Fox, and Yoshi's Island, and... I think Mega Man is one of those. I see, uh, yeah, Me uh, Zelda Girl's actually looking for a copy of that right now, so you should bring that to the store at some point when she's working. Uh, lots of Mario Worlds. A lot of these came from me, because I would pay booth rent with copies of Mario Worlds. <laughs> and then the one Josh gave me is missing the back. What a dick. Oh, I mean, I had to tape the back right Oh, okay. Now. And then what it Josh goes. gives defective games. And then, uh, what else do we got? Lots of all-stars. Jesus. <laughs> Ones with the uh, Mario World. And then two of those. Yeah. And Donkey Kong Countries. Yeah, pretty much the rest of this is all... Mortal Donkey Kombat's Kong. Paper Boys, Mario Paint. Donkey Kong. There's the Donkey Kong stack in his hands. Super... The bottom row isn't quite as impressive. Yeah, the, the top row was the impressive row. Bottom row is just holding up the top row for support. Yeah, yeah exactly. <laughs> then I got this. Yeah, I also have Super Famicom. Super Famicom. That's pretty cool. Mario RPG. All right, so that's basically all the really good stuff. I mean, he does have other random bins full of. Uh, no, not that bin. That's a good bin. Other bins below that full of like cables and systems that are missing pieces, um, but. Uh, he wanted to mention that if you saw anything in here that you actually maybe wanted to buy, definitely uh, send him a message. I'll leave a link to his YouTube channel down below. Um, it's just Aaron Kosharski, but it'll be in the description. 
feel free to send him a message on YouTube and asking. I mean, granted, the sealed stuff, he's not really going to sell it less than what it's going to go for sealed. Yeah, it's only going to go up in price, so yeah. no point in... in letting it go for cheap. But uh, the Super Nintendo and the NES games or whatever, you know, uh, ask him. You know, the worst thing you can say is, or, you know, is, is no, I'm not going to sell it. But yeah. there, there's quite a few things in here. Obviously, you guys saw he has, like, duplicates and triplicates and... and quadruplicates of, of stuff so yeah. uh, anyways i hope you enjoyed this little uh, epic shed game find for <laughs> aaron's game vault but all right see you guys later peace